Hello YouTube, uh, I'm going to be showing you a program I found that works very well to use with your Dazzle or um, any other capture device, even a web camera on your computer. Alright, so you go to this site, freecodex.com slash vhscreencapdriverdownload.htm. Now I'll have this in the description below me if you're on my channel. Um, to the right, if you are uh, just watching it, or if there's ads to the right, it's the bottom right corner, I think. Yeah, it's the bottom right corner. But uh, you go to here, you click download this one, the top, the top link, and I could, I'll just put the link in there, or I'll just put this in there. I don't know, but um, you download it. Once you have it downloaded, you install it, and this is the program you ha you'll have. You can make um, a shortcut by copying the file wherever it's lo wherever you installed it to, and click paste shortcut so you have it on your desktop. Now it's really nice because it's a multicam studio. Now you see my actual desktop here, and if you can go file add camera, you can also do file add file. So if I wanted to add a media file like this video I found for my pog that I will be getting, you can click add in the corner, and I can actually hear the sound. So and then. It, you click on the file down below, remove source. You can also go add camera and do a video web camera. So there you see me talking. Now this is my web camera on my laptop. It's okay. Now I, I can also plug in my Dazzle and show you, actually my friend's Dazzle, but uh, I can show you how that works. So you can have multiple things open where you can make this a smaller screen size so you can have like four different things or eight or as many as you wanted to so I'm just gonna remove my web camera and I'm gonna grab my dazzle oh. now dazzles are can be used for anything but you plug it in um, I'm gonna be using it with my Canon FS10 camcorder and this camcorder is not HD but if you want to step up higher it would be HD and it looks very good it's extremely good quality now this is the Dazzle DV DVC 100 and I borrowed this from my friend it's not all that great it's really it's actually kind of crappy so I if you're looking for a Dazzle to buy don't buy this one trust me all right, so you go add camera, and as soon as you plug it in, if you have the drivers installed, it will pop up here. And so now it's plugged. It's right. Uh, it's right here. And I can just click this, and turn on my camera, and you can see it says movie mode. And it's you can see, like there's my cat. Here, kitty. Yeah, there you see my cat. And here's my dual monitors here. But um it's this is a v extremely nice camcorder where you can flip it and use it. So I'll I will be doing a review on this soon. And um this is extremely nice like ca capture card or multi camera studio. And something cool I found out recently was if you go to tools you can click interact with Skype so if you have Skype you can go down to Skype open it up now I I haven't tested this program to see if it'll work with recording Modern Warfare 2 at all because I just haven't had time I've been so busy with the with the um Christmas holidays and New Year's and stuff like that, but um, I'm just gonna turn off my camcorder for now because I just removed that camera. So this is the multi camera studio, and if you go to, um, so Skype's open, I think. All right, so I'm just gonna preview my video of my Skype. 
Oh, it also, if you open up Skype, it automatically opens up multi-camera studio. Yeah, shut up, Joe. But, um, you can go to call audio settings to test the, uh, quality of the web camera. And it's, it's automatically in the select web camera here, VH multi-cam. Sorry, I don't know why it's acting up like this, but. And here's my VH multi-cam right here. And it's now I'm gonna re plug in my uh I'm gonna put put my dazzle or my friend's dazzle rather back on and you will see that if I go to the Skype and I take click webcam settings. Alright, re reopen VH multicam. So just flip to one of the other ones and um yeah so when you click on that it reopens the uh, multi-camera studio so if I add the dazzle here sorry I'm gonna have to close this other window and then you add you add a camera dazzle DVC 100 and there you see it in here now you also see it on the Skype. Now the only thing about the Dazzle is if you move it, move a camera around, see how it gets all fuzzy? That is a problem. That's not good if you're wanting to record videos for like YouTube, like for from Xbox or Wii or PlayStation. Personally, Xbox is the best, but this is not something you'd want to buy. Oh, there goes my cat going to garbage can. But, um, yeah, this is something you would not want to buy. And there she goes. But, um, anyways, VH Multicamera Studio is very nice. Um, I suggest you download it if you're wanting to record multiple things and not record three different things and put it into one video. Thanks for watching. And don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. Oh, um, one more thing I forgot to mention is that with a VH, with the VH Multi Camera Studio, you can have different presets. So you can have twelve different presets, where you could have this one. I could have my screen cap. This one I could have my web camera, and this one here I could just have um some video. But, um, so the presets are nice because they will always stay there unless you change them. As you can see, there's lots of them. But that's just one last thing I wanted to mention.